This quick guide will show you how to upgrade your Orbs firmware on your iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch device. Before you start, ensure that your phone or tablet's battery is at least 50% charged, you have 10 minutes to spare to complete the upgrade process and that you have a reliable internet connection. So to begin, launch the Fitbug app from the home screen. Then tap on devices. Then select your orb from the list. Next, tap upgrade firmware. To get the orb into the mode which will show you the firmware it has, press and hold the button on the orb until you see the orange light. It usually takes around 5 seconds. So you can see that I have version 1.8 of the firmware, the latest version is 2.8. So I'm going to go ahead and tap upgrade to begin the firmware upgrade process. To get the orb into firmware upgrade mode, you want to press the button on the orb 4 times quickly. On the fourth time, keep it pressed and held. So, one, two, three, four. And on the fourth time, we're keeping it pressed and held. The orange light will flash. When the orange light is flashing, press and hold the button until you see a green light begin to flash. The orb is now in upgrade firmware mode. Before we can continue, we need to switch off Bluetooth and then switch it back on. So, press the home screen button and then open up the settings on your iPhone, go to, into the Bluetooth section and switch off Bluetooth right around maybe 2 or 3 seconds and then switch it back on and go back into the Fitbug app. The light on your orb should continue to flash and the firmware upgrade process should now continue. This usually takes around 10 minutes. You can send the Fitbug app to the background and perform other tasks. The firmware upgrade process will occur in the background. Okay, so the firmware upgrade process has completed and you should see a success message on your screen. Go ahead and tap OK. Next, close down the Fitbug app and open up the settings on your phone. Switch off Bluetooth and switch Bluetooth back on. Then open up the Fitbug app once again. Go ahead and try to upload your steps by pressing the button for half a second. You should see the green lights indicating that your steps are uploading. Now your steps have been uploaded and the date and time has been corrected. The date and time was changed due to the firmware upgrade process and uh, what we can go ahead and do is tap OK here. If you did not see the date and time message pop up, then what you want to do is automatically update the date and time on your orb. So you can do that by going to the devices section then tapping on your orb which is linked to your account then tapping on device setup and you want to press and hold the button on your orb until you see the orange light okay now you're in the device setup screen and you can just press save settings on the device and that links the date and time on your phone to the date and time on your orb